Hello, my Taurian friends. Welcome to Embracing Mattress. This is Renee. This is going to be your weekly love reading for the week of the 19th. Okay. Hope you guys are being safe. Hope your families are well. Right. Um, this is going to be the energy that could be masculine or feminine for the person that you're thinking of, your cross watcher or yourself. And just take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Okay. All right. Let's get into it. Recent past. Oh, Stara, fertility. It's the perfect time for you to start new projects, assess new ideas, and give birth to new conditions. Okay? You guys could be expecting, you know, somebody could be pregnant here. Somebody could be um, having a baby in the spring, or you just could have maybe found out that you're expecting, right? I see the Easter bunny here, right? That's beautiful. Uh, congratulations to, you know, you guys that... Um, are expecting or just recently found out uh, that you are okay so this could be your recent past uh taurus let's see the card here um okay for pentacles um you should, usually this is my greedy card my greedy card that's what i call it the greedy greedy male card right but um let's see you know basically when it comes to the fertility this new idea this new um birth of some nature you know could be a capricorn person in your life as well or someone that has capricorn in the charge you could be being overly cautious right now okay trying to hold on to material wealth trying to make sure that you have everything that you need to survive or to to live your life in a way that you feel like you want to you could be being mean to somebody regarding some money too right fear of letting go of either a person or a, a um material situation or financial situation um you can fear poor health um you know you you could be the type that's really not giving in uh to a situation um this could be you or your person holding on to you or you holding on to them uh creating um a pull like this person or yourself is a possession right this could be some lack of openness lack of um lack of understanding for each other you know you could be blocking or isolating yourself uh from someone it could be a lot of issues here this is the recent past and if this is a person that's pregnant i'm so sorry if you're going through this i i do apologize but future energy sedna infinite supply you are supply for today in all of your tomorrows, meaning that even if this is something that you're, you went through in the recent past, that spirit is here to tell you, you have everything that you need. If you are, you know, fighting someone over money or something of that nature, or you're not letting this person go, or it's a possession, some sort of situation to where you guys are not seeing eye to eye, you know, spirit is saying that everything will work out. And if you're feeling a lack mentality that you already have everything that you need, to make sure that your life is what it needs to be. You don't really have to depend on this person over here, okay? That's what Spirit is saying. You know, you may feel trapped or this person may feel trapped, okay? You guys both could be feeling trapped because of this material uh, type of situation that you guys are going through, you know? Um, it could be that you guys are staying in a relationship out of resources or financial status, like... Both of you have to realize that you're so much more than that. And you don't really have to live in that way because no matter what it is, you know, spirit, God, the universe, whatever it is that you pray for will provide for you. You know, you don't have to live in a lack mentality like that. You don't have to fight each other over this. And no one has to feel stuck in a situation where they feel like there's nothing that they can do about it. And that, that's exactly what I'm seeing here. I'm seeing that someone or either you or your cross watcher or the person that you're thinking of feels stuck. Okay, the person could have Gemini in their charge. This could be about a Gemini or someone, you know, uh, you could have Taurus Gemini in your charge. There's something stuck there regarding a Gemini. Okay, um, yeah, this, there's something, you know. But both of you need to understand that you're surrounded by problems of your own making. This is something that you've done. Okay. And somebody could be feeling with this trap card that they're disempowered. That they don't have the power. They don't have the power to move forward. They can't. They're unable to move forward. Somebody here could be afraid of the future. And this is why spirit is saying everything that you need. Okay. 
You are supplied for today and all of your tomorrows. You just have to take a leap of faith. Now your healing stone for the week, Aqua Aura, healthy communication and relationships, heart-to-heart -heart discussions and clear assertive com communication help you understand and be understood. You guys may need to have a conversation with your partner, your husband, your wife, whomever this is um, that you're in this committed state with, that you're fighting with right now over finances or, or, or material wealth. Uh, so that you guys could come to a different understanding, Taurus, okay? You know, and especially if you are expecting, this is something that you don't want to have to go through, you know? Um, being pregnant is a beautiful stage in, in every woman's life, and you want to get through it in a healthy, sane matter, right? You want to do that. You don't want to be going bananas and feeling like you're trapped in a situation and you have no out, okay? But send in love and light to whoever needs this, um... If you need a personal reading, please holler at me. Okay, let me know. And you guys take care. Stay safe.